Hello, people. It's Troy again with Moden's Rockin' Recollections, um, courtesy of This Ain't the Summer of Love. Blog. This week we are covering uh, Motley Crue and Cheap Trick. This was October 31st, 1997, Halloween night of 97. Um, at the time of this interview, I couldn't remember when Cheap Trick had ever opened up for Motley Crue, but as soon as he said it was Halloween night, I remember in 97, in Tampa, Florida, at the USF Sundome, that's the University of South Florida in Tampa, um, they have a giant dome. Uh, at the college there that they used to hold concerts at. And uh, that night we were supposed to have like a hurricane blowing in. They almost canceled the concert, but they didn't. So we showed up. This this venue holds like uh, eight to 10,000 people. It's kind of like the Metrodome in uh, Minneapolis, Minnesota. It's got like a cloth top. So we're there. And uh, Cheap Trick comes on, puts on an amazing show. You've heard me talk to them before. They're just awesome. But then it's in between uh, the set changes in between Motley Crue and uh, Cheap Trick. Uh, it, it, the storm had kicked up. And every time a giant bolt of lightning would come, we'd look up and it would just light the entire dome up. It was just really cool. I, I, I wasn't tripping, I swear. But... Uh, Anyways, uh, that night, um, it was uh, Generation Swine. That was when Motley Crue was kind of shaky. They were kind of on the downward slide. Uh, not much was expected of them. And, and with a hurricane coming in Florida, uh, like I said, the venue holds about eight to 10,000 people. There was maybe 3,000 people there. It was, it was unbelievable. They put on a good show. Um, they all came out in the... the, the pig head masks and uh, suits. It was pretty cool. The music was good, the night was crappy, and um, that's about it for October 31st, 1997. Have a good day.